Ladies and gentlemen, uh, dear colleagues, uh, in my presentation I would like to talk about our study titled Golden Jackal Opinions versus Facts, Experiences from uh, Serbia and Hungary. Golden Jackal is a widely distributed uh, predator. The geographical range is shown on this map. Uh, due to their uh, tolerance uh, of dry habitats and omnivorous uh, diet, the golden jackal can live in a wide variety of habitats. Uh, this range uh, from Sahel Desert uh, to the evergreen forests of uh, Thailand. They occupy semi-deserts, short to medium grasslands and uh, savannas in Africa, and uh, also uh, forested mangrove agriculture, rural and uh, semi-urban habitats in Bangladesh and uh, India. In Europe, uh, the golden jackal is considered as a native species uh, in the Caucasus, in a Turkish Thrace, and in the Balkan Peninsula. The Pannonian ecoregion uh, is on the northern edge of the uh, jackal's area. The golden jackal uh, spontaneously reoccurred in the Balkans and uh, sev uh, several parts of uh, uh, the Central Europe during the last decades. Both the population size and uh, the occurrence area, area uh, have been continuously uh, increasing since then. Due to the uh, absence of uh, wolf, the golden jackal is the top predator in the uh, majority of its uh, area. At the same time, uh, recolonization uh, marked the beginning of a new conflict uh, situation as well. Uh, because hunters and uh, farmers have permanently been uh, complaining about the damages of, uh, uh, caused by golden jackals uh, on wildlife and also <laughs> domestic uh, species, animals. As you can see on the map, uh, the golden jackals area and the possible spreading routes are shown. Uh, more and more observations are from uh, uh, North East uh, Italy, from Austria, from Slovakia, uh, from Romania and Transylvania. And uh, in this year, there was a, a camera trap, the jackal in Estonia. Our, aim, our aims were to present the most important uh, scientific results from Serbia and uh, from Hungary. And uh, uh, our aim was to compare uh, them with the, the, the scientific results with the other uh, managers and uh, others' opinion, uh, which is uh, published in many kind of uh, medias, especially in the next uh, following uh, topics. So we studied the population trend and the population density, the changing in distribution area in uh, both countries, the feeding habits of the jackal, and uh, damages on livestock and uh, wildlife. We had uh, several methods during our study. Uh, first, we uh, had a mail questionnaire survey between uh, 1997 and 2006 uh, in every year. Uh, in Serbia, also had a questionnaire with the, local, with the involvement of uh, local hunters. We uh, collected and analyzed the hunting bank data in Serbia and also in Hungary. And we used the acoustic population survey in both countries and had a feeding analysis uh, also in uh, Hungary and Serbia. The main questionnaire survey was based on a voluntary response with the involvement of the game management units uh, as a well-functioning data supplying system uh, extended to the whole country uh, between uh, 1997 and 2006. As you can see, uh, in the first year, only uh, four uh, game managers uh, said that uh, they had a jackal, but in the last year, in 2006, uh, 67 uh, game keeper and uh, game management unit uh, stated that they had uh, at least one obs jackal observation in this year. So the main questionnaire survey uh, uh, based data shows the core areas in Hungary uh, are in the south part of the country 
and we can see that there were some positive answers uh, close to River Tissa and uh, River uh, Danube. Uh, we collected and analyzed the hunting back data, official hunting back data in Hungary uh, between this uh, period. Uh, you can see in 1997 there were only uh, uh, six uh, specimens shot, and then in the 2012, in the last year, uh, it was uh, 1,660 uh, uh, animals shot. The situation is uh, almost the same in uh, Serbia. In 2000, 180 uh, specimens were shot, and uh, in 2012, now it is uh, uh, 2,500, the hunting bag is. Uh, there is a map uh, of uh, Serbia, and you can see the core areas in the country. Results of the acoustic survey also shows the same. I'm sorry, there is something wrong with the uh, presentation. Uh, but it shows that uh, the southern part, the, uh, the significant fraction of the jackal population is in the southern part of the Hungary, of uh, Hungary, uh, and uh, migration supposedly happened from the uh, south border from Croatia across the river Drava. We had uh, uh, some uh, responses and uh, uh, groups close to the river uh, Tisza and river Danube, uh, and it shows that uh, gallery woods and flute plains play uh, an important role in uh, spreading of the species as uh, green corridors. And uh, now I would like to show some uh, uh, results of our bilateral project. Uh, this is population density and feeding habits of the golden jackal in different habitats in the Pannonian ecoregion. First, I would like to show some uh, results from the uh, diet composition of the jackal in Hungary. Uh, on the basis of scat analysis, uh, we found that jackals consumed primary small mammals. Uh, and the most dominant uh, Small mammal is a pest species. It's, this is a common wall. The secondary was uh, uh, wild boar, but it is mainly in uh, winter and springtime. And also the plants were uh, important during the autumn, almost uh, 30 or uh, 40 biomass percentage. Uh, it is very uh, important to mention that uh, uh, in wild, uh, the uh, wildlife management of uh, point of view, the surveys were uh, uh, wasn't as high as expected. It was only in winter and some in spring, and about uh, five and uh, two biomass percentage. So the situation in uh, Serbia, uh, domestic animals uh, remains were the main source of food of golden jackals in this country. Uh, especially in winter, it was the highest uh, quantity. Uh, also, the plants were very uh, uh, important during the summer. This means uh, berries, fruits, and grass, uh, and others. And uh, small mammals also were important on average uh, 25 percentage. And uh, as you can see, uh, game species uh, uh, weren't significantly re represented uh, in the diet of the jackal in the region of uh, Veliko Gradishta in the Serbian uh, uh, study area. So uh, our uh, acoustic survey uh, results uh, shows, uh, besides some fluctuation in both country, in both uh, um, study areas, had a, had a stable uh, population. The group density was about uh, two groups in a uh, uh, thousand hectares in Serbia, and a little, little bit more than uh, uh, half uh, groups in Hungary. In case of feeding habits, our examination uh, uh, confirms the earlier results from Hungary. Uh, this is uh, this is that the jackal has opportunistic feeding strategy. Its uh, diet. Uh, 
uh, where it is depending on the seasonal uh, food availability. But the small mammals were the most important uh, food item in every season. Results of the project uh, shows, uh, uh, results of the, of the project uh, are not supported uh, of the believing of the serious damages on uh, different valuable uh, prey species of the jackal. Uh, and uh, finally, I can state that golden jackal is a really unknown and uh, a mysterious uh, species in Europe uh, due to the fact that uh, it was absent in the last uh, 20 year, uh, in the most of the 20th century, sorry. Uh, our scientific and uh, practical uh, management knowledge is, is quite little, and most of the scientific uh, programs started in the last 20 years, uh, uh, parallel with the uh, population explosion. I think that uh, further field studies uh, need to be done in order to broaden our knowledge about the golden jackal and to understand uh, the ecological impact better of the species. And thank you for your attention.